What's up, everybody? Frosty here, and welcome back to another episode of Single Player Tarkov Season 2. On today's episode, we are going to have to jump into customs as we have a number of quests to do. Number one is checking from proper. We have a bunch of dailies to take care of there as well. We're looking for Salewas and Uskras for Therapist and Jaeger. So we're going to be doing a couple customs raids today. But before we jump into this episode, I do want to give a shout out to the Single Player Tarkov subreddit. Uh, I found out that my name was brought up in a thread in terms of single player Tarkov YouTubers. So thank you for that. I appreciate the shout out there. Feel free to link my videos if you want. I give permission for that. I don't do any sort of self-promotion. I just kind of do my own thing here, post on Twitter, uh, post in our Discord, and that's about it. I don't do any of the, the whole Reddit thing. So if you're wondering if you can post my videos, go ahead and do that. Share it with your friends. I appreciate it. If you are looking to talk single player Tarkov or just Tarkov in general, link to our discord is below we have a bunch of channels there for all sorts of games i myself personally play everything from fighting games to card games first person shooters uh strategy games i'm kind of just an overall gamer so let's see you stop by say hi talk about some shit. but with all that out of the way let's get to this episode all right and here we are i'm already loaded out uh from the last time now one thing i have changed uh since the previous episode is i've changed the plate mod that i've been using I, the original one was by cobra i believe um and the, this one i'm using i believe their username is galaty but um what they've done is they've kind of changed how it necessarily works uh vests and some other plate carriers uh are normal as they are in tarkov um but there's now some new ones um, and it looks like, yeah, so there's a slick here, but the slick itself uh, has no armor. It is This is just the carrier. So um, I don't see where I can buy plates. Maybe I have to find them. I didn't test this mod out before I started recording, so that's probably my bad. Uh, oh, here we go. Okay. So level three plate uh, you can grab from Peacekeeper. Uh, and then this is for, was for arms, armored areas. Yeah. Left arm, right arm. Okay. So if I bought this plate carrier, the slick plate carrier, um, this would give me no armor. And then I would go ahead and grab this level three from peacekeeper. And that would give me a level three plate, uh, essentially for that raid. Um, is there any other plates? Doesn't look like it. Maybe as we level up the... Oh, here we go. Skier's got level 2. Level 2 at 60k. So what is this? 60. Okay. Man, that makes that kind of expensive. <laughs> when you think about it. If you want swappable plates, right? Because um, this is 54k. So to make a level 3 plate... It would be like 112k, whereas this is just a level three for for 56. So I don't know. We're gonna try it out. We'll see if we like it. If we don't, we can always swap back to the other one. Um, these mods are, are pretty interchangeable. You know, uh, if you remove the mod, it removes all the items and it changes all your stuff back. So as we when we left the last uh, raid, I had a bunch of armor in here. Well. Those are gone now. They're deleted. So, um, makes no difference. And, uh, we're definitely just trying to, uh, try some things out and see where things go. But let's jump into customs and try and get some of these quests done. All right. Hello, customs. Ooh, this is actually a really good spawn for us. Um, we are going to need to hit crack house for Soleil was, uh, we need three Iskras. And we need to actually get to dorms in order to grab the pocket watch key. And we can come back to grab the pocket watch. So I'm wondering what the best line is going to be. I think going to dorms first is probably best. So let's go ahead and head that way. We're going to try and grab uh, keys if we can while we're in dorms. We'll take a little bit of time. Oops. Didn't mean to open up too. What? All right. 
No, wait. Uh, sometimes there's keys up here. All right, nothing. Now, if you are new to single player Tarkov, uh, join in the community after the, uh, we'll just call it the incident. Um, welcome. We have a lot of fun here. We try and, uh, enjoy Tarkov and, you know, just be nice to each other as we all actually love this game, regardless of if you play on live or not. It's a fun, customizable experience. Uh, I already have some ideas maybe for either an offshoot uh, series or uh, for next season because I keep looking at that realism mod and I really want to try it. <laughs> but I want to go full send on it. I don't want to like pick and choose pieces of it. Um, realism mod is a complete overhaul that changes basically everything ab about the game. All right, hearing shots. Uh, it sounds like over by maybe Fortress. Save up a little bit of stamina here and just run across. Oop. We do have a couple dailies that we need to take care of. Uh, need to kill two scavs. Need to uh, find a can of max energy and a syringe, which I already have a syringe to hand in, but I think I need that for med station one. So finding a second one's probably ideal. We're going to go straight up into the third floor and then work our way down. I do see sniper scav. No shot I hit this, right? Oh, get freaking wrecked. I'm the best at this game. All right. Hello. here nobody key we need is on floor two but there's a number of jackets to check before we head that way Let's go full auto while we're in here Well, that's new. That means... Somebody in here? Who are you? Just a random scav. I'm not going to start collecting the cigarettes yet. Car kit. Power substation. I never actually found that damn thing. Um, I heard you. Sounds like they're on the second floor, maybe? They've got to be on the second floor, right? 
Um, okay. Full send. Well, you're somewhere. Somewhere down here. I'm being overly cautious. Probably went into that room. To it on the first floor? Okay. Possible first floor. Just looking for Iskras. Another ketter. I don't need two ketters. Okay. We're going to make the jump over here. Grab the machinery key. Can I swap out the... Oh, shit, I can. Uh, this is probably a bad idea. What? Can't attach while in raid. Shit. Can I put this... What? You can... Okay, sure. That makes sense. <laughs> yeah, that, that scav's definitely on uh, first floor, so we're actually going to ignore them. And we're just going to head to the... Uh, get the machinery key done. Sound like the second sniper scav. I like I'm gonna be able to see. Cause I'm blind as a bat. Which is a dumb phrase, cause bats aren't blind. But whatever. Oh shit! Oh shit! that one though <laughs> oh man that sucked what that was a slug okay well good news is we didn't lose too much on that 
Um, we got the machine of your key already. Um, so it means we don't have to go to dorms to get it again. We can just get the golden watch and work our way out. So I'm going to go ahead, suit up, and we will get back into a customs raid to finish off these quests. All right. We back. Um, oh, we are on the opposite side of where I want to be, but that's okay. Um, this gives us a chance to loot a little bit. There's sometimes some med stuff um, back here. Not always, though. MDR barrel. Oh, actually, I mean, take it. But. All right. Rip. Actually, those are shocking around, so I might as well. We are rocking the, the uh, Saiga for this run. So no long distance shots, but that's okay. Not going to need them. We can start collecting T plugs, wires, spark plugs, all good things to start to get. Wait, what? Oh, those are electronic components. Those are actually like important. Um, we have our machinery key on us. So we don't need to have to go to dorms for that. Oh, hello. Give me my chocolate bar. Oh, no. What was that gun? That sounded like it was right out here. Weird. Maybe I, there's no way I was like imagining that. Uh, Geiger counters actually sell for like 10k, so useful. Thermite. Uh, I didn't get a chance to search this, right? Yeah. Hot rods. Good. All right. So I think let's go ahead and start to move towards the uh, truck. Kind of want to take the short way through the courtyard. Not always the best idea. I'm actually loaded with slugs right now, so I got to be mindful of that. Oop. No sniper scav up. Head into the warehouse here. We can check the back for any uh, med stuff, food. Sometimes there's like headphones and stuff here. 
What the hell is this? Oh. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, that'll be very handy. Hand drill. Don't need right now. Power bank is money. There's a barter for the the roach spray. I just don't remember what it necessarily is. Okay. Cool. Oh, I'm going to be heavy now, though. I got to be careful. Body armor kit's uh, 20 kilos, so... Jesus. Is that the, um, was that a mounted gun? Uh, how am I going to get through here? Um, we'll go up. <laughs> I did speed up reloads, um, reloads and unloads just to uh, save a little bit of time. So that was a PMC. I have to remember the Saiga shoots really high. So I got I got to aim fairly low. Get wrecked, nerd. So now we got a little bit of GT rounds. Ooh. Heavy now. Um, okay, let's see here. What were you loaded with? Just PS? Yeah. Okay. Get rid of that. Uh you weigh so much. Fine, we'll just have to take it slow. Somebody got shot here. What the hell? Somebody got shot here. Are they still alive? Nothing on the giving tree. Oh, 
Oh, I gotta load that thunder. Holy shit. Oh, okay. Uh, I think I need this for... What do I need this for? Uh, nutrition. All right, we're going to move a little slow uh, with how heavy we are. I do not want to put myself in, like, a shitty position, so... Oh, fortress is going to be a problem, though. Because I still need to get to... Let's see. Let's, let's plan this out. Ruaf will be good. Um... So if we can get to the car, then we can hop over to ref. So wish me luck. Hmm. Heavy. Gonna avoid fortress uh, this time around considering what's in our bag i just want to get to the vehicle get the watch and then work our way towards the ref i do want to make it out with this body armor kit so i might start ditching some other things my armor doesn't help either I think I just heard somebody on the other side of this wall. Guess not. We're almost there. shit is that somebody on the oh, somebody's on the AGL oh no well this is gonna suck don't you switch leave me no 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 come on that's not fair Ah, God dang it. <sighs> Screw you, Lunar. <laughs> oh, I knew Fortress would be a problem. I should have, I should have took the Augmented and just, that's what screwed me is it broke my leg. Let's try again. All right, never mind this monstrosity of a gun that I have. Um, <laughs> let's, let's just get to where we need to get to and actually complete a damn task. Man, freaking AGL, really? Like, <laughs> that was painful. Ooh, PK06, sure. 45 rip. The Devastator. I would love to be able to find another gun in here. But that might not happen. What we really need is either a helicopter crash or an airdrop. Like, right as we're about to leave. That would be perfecto.
Hey, there's one Iskra. And our first flashlight. All right. Oh, it's the freaking the stupid one, isn't it? Damn it. <laughs> it's the IR one. That's okay. I'll just sell it. Vitamins. I actually need those. And that will allow us to complete the uh, med station. Decent win there. Anybody at gas? Doesn't look like it. Definitely going to be skipping over it, though. Trying to stay light and nimble. Just straight to the car or the truck. Get the pocket watch. Hit crack house, leave through Rora. That is the plan. I think I want to actually go through the front by ice cream shack. Or do I just go in through here? Ah, screw it. No, not a bush. Okay. Hello, truck. Yeah. Gotcha. All right. Crack house is next. going through the back. Giggity. Hello, housekeeping. I already have my salt. Uh, ooh, T sells for a lot. A lot being like 12k or something. We got 5 for 5 PS. HP. I'll take the PS. PS isn't bad. Go ahead and drink this now. Yeah, 
Anything? Isn't there like a jacket in here or some shit? Oh no, this is just so like you can find soap, I think. What the hell was that? Oh, heavy bleed fix. Uh, nothing else? That's a freaking bummer. No, 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 no. Ah, Why did I not just dump to the ground? Damn it. I knew it. I freaking, I had a feeling. Son of a. Fortress is becoming like just a death zone. At least I think I can make the med station now, right? Um, I think I need to buy like a bandage or something. I need to buy two bandages. Easy. Okay. So this is done. All right. Well, I'm very quickly running out of gear. So, um, luckily, I still have my key. So we can try this again. Uh, I'm going to gear up with whatever I can find. And then uh, we'll do uh, one more try. Try and get this damn pocket watch. All right. Here we are back. I'm down to the last little bit of what gear I have. We got the Lonely Cutter. Um, we're spawning at Old Gas, which is not bad. It means we can drop into the warehouse here. Search the back shelves for anything. I need money, so that helps. <laughs> Uh, I'm already down to like, think like 200,000 rubles or something. It's been rough. It has been a rough start. That's for sure. Uh, ooh. Nope. Nothing else. Actually put those in here. Cause I need those for a, for the workbench. Another car kit. Helpful. I now have like half a mind too to actually just like clear out fortress before I do anything. May not be the best idea, but man, I'm getting just absolutely hammered by those AGLs and mounted guns. problem is making it to the fortress. Hey, look, money. Any on the ground? No. Okay. Crack house is like my best chance of making like decent money um because of all of the drawers and stuff upstairs it's just a matter of getting out getting to it and then getting out what all right sorry bolts and a gas analyzer. Oh, shit, son. Lex, I'm just going to probably sell. <laughs> um, all right. Chances I die. Fairly high. But you know what? Screw it. Tired of living in fear. I have a Keter with like shit ammo.
You son of a bitch. Good money. I swear if there's there's actually nobody here. And a serve kit? What? What is this? So much money. I want to grab as many of the ash uh, marks as I can because they are used for actually crafting Salewas. Now we still got to go grab the pocket watch. And I, I don't even think I want to go upstairs. I should clear it though. Just, just to like double check. Really hear anybody? Actually empty. Wow. Check this for iskras. and top off energy and hydration. Uh, let me go check the back for a Salewa. Because there's a... This is a tech crate. Uh, med crate is this one. far so good all right now i think my plan is gonna be let's go grab the pocket watch i know you guys are probably already commenting just leave but we can't we need a zip pocket watch i thought that was a guy for a second I'm going to go through elbow, um, like through the mechanics garage. No, oh, I touched a bush. Anything? Nope. Uh, nope. And then we'll head straight through here.
No balls. Ref is our out. Pretty sure. Yeah. So gonna die, aren't I? Эй, земляк, мы стрелять не хотим, мы так наблюдаем. You're defending where I need to go, buddy. I dislike this, capiche? No, 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 no. Shit, 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 shit. <laughs> this gun sucks. God, I don't know what he's running. At this moment that he knew he fucked up you have an alton what the fuck screw that That's not gonna that's not gonna do anything anyway we made it we got out we got some money too which is good we're gonna sell all that crap turn the pocket watch oh that was stressful 
All right, that was a good haul for uh, the third time's a charm again. Got the pocket watch. We got out. We got two gas analyzers, which is fantastic. It means we only need one more um, for therapist. And that is going to do it for this episode of Single Player Tarkov. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment below. Tell me what your favorite moment was. And if you've enjoyed the channel so far, feel free to subscribe. New episodes of Tarkov drop every Tuesday and Thursday. There are other series on the channel as well, so feel free to check those out. My name is Frosty, and I'll see you next time.